So good morning, everybody. It's a great pleasure to speak in front of you, in front of this audience, and especially in front of Gerd Bigerenzer. Is it possible to transfer the spirit of the ABC group to another institution, to the German Football Association? That's the question we want to answer within the next two, three, four, five, ten years. So we are looking to the future. In 2014, the German Football Association became champion of the world in Brazil. We beat Argentina. And after 24 years, um, we were back on the summit of the entire football world. But we are not satisfied. We want to keep that title. We want to defend the title in 2018 and 2022. And therefore, we have to develop our institution, we have to develop ourselves and therefore we have started and initiated a new project called the DFB Academy. So that's, I forgot to uh, show you the first slide. So we had a lot of talks uh, between Gerd Bigerenzer and our head, Oliver Bierhoff. And then the next slide I would show you, or I would like to show you a short movie that gives you a feeling what we build up in Frankfurt with our new DFB Academy and where we want to try to put in this ABC spirit. So I hope in 2020 we could really say welcome to the new DFB. But we don't just need such a building, we want to do much more. We want to create a new culture, we want to get in a new spirit, because we want to develop not, not only the institution, we want to develop our colleagues, we want to develop these, in the best cases, 7 million people who go to the stadium, who play football, and uh, therefore, we, that's our dream to build this uh, new DFB Academy. And Oliver Bierhoff, the head, uh, always says, we want to become the Silicon Valley and Harvard of football <laughs> worldwide. So I would like to change this to, uh, we want to become Silicon Valley, okay, but I would replace Harvard with the Max Planck Society, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> So what's the reason? We want to try, we want to put in more technology and when our colleagues say more technology, I'm the only person in the DFB who raises his hand, his hand and says, okay, no more data do not more data do not lead to better decisions. So be careful when talking about new technology. <laughs> and Harvard or Max Planck Society means we want to involve more scientific data, more scientific knowledge. And my task is to do an implementation of a new module called Think Tank and Open Innovation Network. And every time when I 
went into this building and uh, spoke to Gerdi Gerenzer, to Sabrina, to Niklas Keller, to Roma, to Shatnam, to Reza, and all of your colleagues, I said that I want to try to transfer and to copy the spirit of this ABC crew in this think tank. And I just want to give you a feeling what I understand on the think tank. On the left hand side you can see innovation desks where people will sit in the future who have new ideas, who do projects and we have started a um, pilot project for example calling perception and cognitive training we have started a pilot project on another innovation desk called, called Prevention of Muscle Injuries. And from my point of view, it's very important that we get different people around the table, that we get scientists, that we get the coaches, that we get, get the uh, coaches for athletic and uh, or strength and conditioning coaches, that we get the uh, clubs, for example, Hoffenheim, that we get companies, Striver, for example, from the Silicon Valley, uh, who support us to, with virtual reality. So that's not easy to bring all these guys together, get them in a discussion, get them in an argue. But that's what I've learned here uh, while talking to, to you. It's important to bring as most as possible perspectives around the table and just listening or just listen to the discussion. Furthermore, a big aim is to transfer scientific knowledge to the community and therefore we have started a new project called science to go I will mention it later on. And the last thing is within this think tank is a technology lab where we want to develop new te technology related to football together with our partners, for example SAP or editors. So the most important thing is to share knowledge from all over the world, bring the people together with the aim to develop the game, to develop the German national team and especially or also the society. But I want to put your focus not on these projects, I want to put your focus on uh, th this project I call the spirit of ABC because it's my personal dream to put in um, some ideas for the way you work together in this core think tank. And what does it mean, this spirit? So I'm, I was here in the, in the uh, Max Planck Institute maybe seven, eight, nine, ten times. So you're more, more involved. But from my point of view, uh, these words or phrases are uh, or do characterize the ABC group. And that's what I want to implement together with Oliver Bierhoff, together with Markus Weiss and all my colleagues who have already visited the Max Planck Institute for Human Development. So international, intercultural, put in as many perspectives as possible. Make an easy world. And maybe the most important thing, hire well and let them do their job and give them the freedom of research. So that's not easy within our institution, but with the support of Niklas, Sabrina, also Gerd Dikarenza, Risa and all uh, the colleagues, I, I look in the future and I hope that we get it. And we have already started uh, with, with some workshops. And the first thing we want to do within the DFB is a think tank talk. You know it much better, maybe the Wednesday talk. So we try to bring in some experts from outside of the DFB to talk, to give a presentation. Science to go to communicate scientific data. We have worked together with uh, Roman Prinz, uh, where we try to communicate scientific data and using, you call it, uh, fact boxes um, to give our community, to give the players, the coaches, easy information. And we have prepared, or Roman have, has prepared such a fact box concerning uh, the effect of a prevention training in terms of uh, injuries in the knee. So does it work or not? And that's quite easy to read. And our colleagues say, yes, that's what we want to have. That's easy and now we understand science. <laughs> yep. So, I finished, we are at the very beginning. So hopefully in the next years, 
we're going to build up not only this building, we want to change the culture, we want to bring in a new spirit, and I'm looking forward to work with all of you, so I invite you to support us, to be part also of the DFB, and um, yeah, I would say thank you very much, get deeper into for all your inspirations, all your ideas, all the talks, not only with me, also with Oliver Bierhoff and the head coach of the national um, team, Jürgen Löw, last Monday in Hannover, and again, thank you very much, it's a great pleasure to talk to you. Thank you.